Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Gran Turismo 5. Today is episode number 29. Hopefully, you guys do enjoy. Right, so today, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be starting off with this Like the Wind Extreme series, and we are going to be driving uh, the fastest car in the game so far. Uh, where are you? There you are. The Bugatti Veyron. Um, hopefully. Our little Bugatti is going to do us very proud in this. Listen to that engine. That is an amazing sounding engine. Alright. So first off is Daytona International Speedway. I know in the past we've had a couple of problems with this with the Veyron. Uh, and then the Indianapolis Speedway. So let's do this. Right. So we are here at the Daytona Road Course. Let's do this. Hopefully we can win. Uh, it would be great to see us. Get a dub here. One. And off we go. And that. That is how it's done. Perfect. Hopefully we can keep up this uh, momentum throughout the rest of the race. Look how wide this thing is. This thing is like... Massive. Epic. Right, slowing down for this final corner here. Once we are off here, we are onto the straight section or the oval section. Round we go. Nice, 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 nice. Right, we are coming up to the, I think it's called the bus stop. I'm pretty sure I've heard that uh, spread around a couple of times. And this is the one where we would spin out quite a lot. Didn't spin out today. No, thank you. Awesome. Perfect. All I'm aiming to do is to keep the cars behind me. I'm not aiming to gain distance. But that corner was amazing and we gained loads of distance through there. Okay, that didn't go as well. Perfect. Right, we are 0.5 seconds behind, but hopefully we can regain the lost distance. And we are quite easily doing that. Here we go. Let's get the perfect line through here. Break at the right opportunity. Obviously, that car can break a little bit later than us. I don't like that I'm behind him, though. I want to try and get ahead of him. And then once I'm ahead... Oh! I then don't have to worry about him. That was very close there, though. So the tyres on the right side of the car are heating up very much. There we go, nice. Perfect.
Don't let him come on the inside there. Okay, cars are catching up slowly. This is probably the most weirdest walkthrough of this game. Like, none of these cars are ordinary or what you would expect most people to drive. Like, I've seen a lot of people, that Suzuki Pikes Peak car, I've seen loads of people doing this with that. And, to be honest, I wasn't expecting the Bugatti to be able to hold up as well as this. Um, but yeah, it is holding up very well. Right, we have two more laps to go after this. Come on, come on, come on. Perfect. Nice. Right, slow in, slow in. Keep it steady. We're obviously, um, after the last three episodes, we had um, the rally car. So we've obviously been using automatic, but I have for no 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 for this race that was so close um and this race onwards we will be back to the manual gearbox unless we have another rally in which case we'll probably go back down but i ha have a feeling we won't because i think all of a spec is just on road stuff and the rally is reserved just in the special thing Awesome. Come on, come on, come on. That is looking very good there. Right, this is the final lap. That is the best we've taken that corner yet. That is very good. We are s barely scraping this win off the ground right now. The cars are right behind. <laughs> there is one lonely little guy just like miles behind. What a lonely little guy just like. Mm. Not even going to make it to the winner's circle. These cars are going to try and overtake me, but I'm going to try and not let them. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go. Finish. Finish. I have a feeling if they had that voice, it would be so much better. Just like, finish. Eight minutes and 20 seconds for the race time. Look at that. Right, so we are here for race number two at the super speedway. We have four corners. That's all we have. We'll only be turning left. Yes, left. We are starting seventh, so hopefully our car can... Ah, that is a problem. We may not be winning positions with this.
Yeah, we are last. I don't think we're going to win this race. Slight feeling we will not win. I want to try... Does the... You can't wall ride in this game. What? Oh. Well, we tried and failed. Quite miserably as well. 7.9 seconds. Gaddy, why are you doing me like this? To be fair, this track is kind of disgusting. Indianapolis, I think, shouldn't exist just because of the way that the track is. <laughs> Look at it, it's squint. Like, if you have to slow down that much for a corner, on an oval circuit, only a few cars are going to be able to make that around there at 170 miles an hour. The rest is going to be like me in a slow little Bugatti at the back of the pack. I do love the Bugatti though. And we may have <laughs> scraped a win with the last one but for this one no the fact is the cars are all have like a constant acceleration and they're able to take it through the corners so once we hit 210 most of them are topping out but we're only managing to hit 220 before we have to start braking and that is the problem with this it is a huge problem. The tyres are already struggling. That's how you know it's a bit rubbish. You know, I'm actually probably going to get lapped, knowing my luck. Twenty-three seconds. They are halfway onto the next lap already. Come on! Come on! Come on! Awesome. It's pretty cool just driving it anyways. So I know we've lost it, but who cares? We're not aiming for gold for every single race anyways. That's not the aim of this playthrough. The aim is to just complete everything. Which I haven't done. Here we go. Finish. Very bad. 28 seconds behind. To be fair, though, the Subaru Dirt Car, the one that I was expecting to... Uh, not Subaru, Suzuki. That I was expecting to do the best out of this, did the worst. Apart from our Veyron. Apart from our Veyron. Right, so now we are going back to the NASCAR school. So we have uh, joining the pack after leaving the pits. We've also got the last two laps of Indianapolis and the last two laps of Daytona. So let's do this. Right, so we are here to learn about joining the pack after leaving the pits. Let's give this a try. Let's are go. You ready? Are you ready? Right, so we're completely auto driving now. Do we have to sit through this pit thing every single time? Right, put the tyres on that side. Yes, please. Thank you. Are 
Here we go. Perfectly choreographed pit stop. And out we go, ready. Whereabouts is the finish marker? Oh, we have to do two more laps as well. Let's go. We've overtaken one, overtaken two. We've got three more to overtake. Come on, come on, come on. Not looking good here. Yeah, we're only going to get a bronze for this one. Here we go. Across the line. Bronze medal. I'll take that. Right, so we are here to do the last two laps of the Indianapolis. Let's do this. See how well this goes. Get ready. We are in last place. Wow. Okay. Do be dirty like that. Thank you. Two to go. I think they did say this was after a full course restart as well, so... Come on, let's go, let's do this. We've got three cars already. One has just overtaken us. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, what is that? Wow. Okay. Right, let's go again. Two, one. Go. Two to go. Two to go. Here we go. Come on, come on, come on. Any form of contact isn't allowed. Ready? Right, I think what we're gonna have to do is do this view to make sure no one crashes into us. Green flag, go. Green flag, go. Not touch me. There we go. What are you doing? Stay back. This is my win. Two, one, go. Go, go, go.
What are you doing? How did you get from the back of the pack to in front of me? Perfect. We've got to get two more positions. Oh, this is going to be a push. Bandworthy. <laughs> Old Spice. Here we go, here we go. We got the bronze. We got the bronze medal. Yes. You made it. Right, we are here for the last two laps of Daytona now. Let's do this. Hopefully it can go as well as Indianapolis just went. Two, one, go, go, go. Two to go. Two to go. Right, we've got to stick behind the Energizer car. There we go, nice. Yeah, this has gone horribly wrong. I think we need to retry. Ready? Go, go, go. Green flag, go. He is so close behind me there. How are we supposed to catch up with the rest of the pack when it gets away like that? There is no way of doing this. How do you do this? Ready? Two to go. Maybe if I try sticking behind this car. Now we've lost this slipstream. We lost it. Right, we'll give it one more try. If we can't get it, we can't get it. Go, 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 go. No, the Energizer car, get out of the way. You're not a battery anymore. Move. Go, 
Right, we lost their slipstream. And the Energizer cars come straight back again. What on earth are you doing? I am gonna have to watch a video on this. Uh -oh. What is? Like that's fair. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. If you want to keep up to date with all the stuff going on on the Mechanic CG channel, then be sure to go take a look in the description for links of socials and all sorts of other places and also we have finally got merch down there so go check that out and if you want to help support the channel hit that join button it means the world to me and i will see you in the next one goodbye Run for your fucking life